everyone, Elise McDowell here from houseofbrazen.com. And today I'm going to be talking about the three free strategies that I use to promote my digital products. So I could actually tell you to use every social media platform out there to promote your product. You could actually, but um, to be honest, I don't really feel like they all work. So today instead, I'm going to talk to you about the specific platforms I've used that work for me. So number one is Facebook groups. I absolutely love Facebook groups and I think they're the best thing that have been friggin' invented for ages um, because it's an amazing way to be a part of a community but also to have the space to promote yourself, to promote your, your blog, your business, what you do and also your products. So that's what I recommend you to do. Get into some Facebook groups start interacting, start networking, getting to know the people. And then when they have a promotional thread, that's your chance to promote your product. I have done this several times and I've always made sales from Facebook groups. And I think it's such an, a powerful platform for that. And I think also it's because um, it's like a, a social element, like you are actually speaking to a person rather than it's just being put up on social media like um, a Facebook page or a Twitter um, tweet or on Pinterest. It's that's less social, whereas Facebook is very social, <laughs> social media. Uh, <laughs> number two is through my email list. So some of you might be thinking, but you have to pay for email like service providers. You do. Most of the time you do. But there are some platforms that allow you to, to grow your list for free, like MailChimp. So I would recommend to join up to MailChimp if you haven't already and start growing your list. If you have a list already, awesome. You can make so much money from your list, your current list that you have right now. All you need to do, actually know, yeah, I've got a really good example. So when I was launching my um, affiliate affluence course, all I did to pre-sell it was I sent two emails to my list uh, within 24 hours to say, Hey, I'm launching this course. I've got it at an affordable rate for you for the next 24 hours because you're on my list and I love you. So if you want to get on board, feel free to sign up for it here. And I said that. And then I sent them a reminder email about 12 hours later to let them know that they've got this amount of time to buy. And then the price has obviously gone up. And I had like 12 sales from that just from two emails. Two emails. You can totally do that. And it's free. <laughs> and then number three, I would a thousand percent recommend to create a sales funnel. Um, so how you would do that is you usually create an email sequence. I would recommend doing an email course, a free email course first. Um, you might actually think, but MailChimp charges for that and they do. But I've actually heard another platform called MailerLite actually lets you do automations for free. That's amazing. That's so amazing. So you can actually create your first sales funnel for free. So get on there, create a free email course that's to do with your product, lead them through that sequence, and then watch as the sales roll in from this automated sequence that you have. So you don't even have to be there to be making the sales, which is awesome. So that's my three tips for you today. Three free strategies that you can use to start promoting your digital products. Um, I would love to know any free methods that you have used yourself to promote your digital products and let me know what you did in the comments below. Other than that, please subscribe to my channel and I will catch you in the next episode.